Dub Nation goes forward. Big Bad Gary goes in. Here's into a hot spot. Buck Dwayne is in. And 250 coup to the outside gate. Goes in. All in. And away they go. Off awkwardly, it was Bully for Eric. Bully for Eric last. Into a hot spot broke well, but so did 250 Koo, and 250 Koo goes on to lead them. Big Bad Gary kicks through at the rail now to get third. Behind that is Buck Dwayne. Bully for Eric has recovered. Only three and a half off the leader. Dub Nation is at the back. They tightly group, they run past the half mile pole and Big Bad Gary comes through down at the rail. Into a hot spot, 250 coup on the far side, three of them in a line. Dub Nation now starts to get a little closer as well. Buck Dwayne is right there, bully for Eric at the back, but only three lengths covers the entire field. They are coming towards the quarter pole and it's 250 coup now taking a narrow advantage. Into a hot spot goes with him. Dub Nation coming four wide, but Dub Nation comes to tackle them. Big Bad Gary gives way, then Buck Dwayne and Bully for Eric. They're at the top of the lane now and the whole picture changes. Dub Nation on the outside up to grab the lead. 250 coup trying to go with him. Coming with a late run is Buck Dwayne. Buck Dwayne is flying on the outside and Buck Dwayne has just mowed them all down to win, going away. Buck Dwayne convincingly in the end. Dub Nation was second, 250 coup and into a hot spot. The unofficial result, the winner number three, Buck Dwayne. Second number four, Dub Nation. Third number six, 250 Coup. And fourth was number five, Into a Hot Spot. Now entering the Compass Winner's Circle, number three, Buck Dwayne. He's a four-year-old bay gelding by Inter Mischief out of Mally Girl. He's owned by Steve Knapp and is also trained by Steve Knapp. The winning jockey, Mario Gutierrez. The winner was bred in California by Nick Alexander.